Okay, so I thought I'd make a video talking about how to fix a Riot client not opening because this is an issue I've been having lately with it. Where, uh, you know, it's been on my taskbar, I try to open it, well, it doesn't actually open. So, um, example here, it might do it here. Yeah, it's doing it right now. As you can see, I'm clicking on it, but it's not opening. And even in my task manager, it'll actually show up right here, but it'll instantly close itself. And there probably is a actual reason for this, uh, but I'm going to just be pretty much showing a workaround for it. A permanent fix would probably just be uninstall and then reinstall but if you don't want to do that and having to reinstall like 100 gigabytes worth of games like i do because i have three games installed and you might want to use this fix you're just going to want to look up one of the games so for example here valorant i try to open that up pretty much what happens is it opens riot client like this that just manually opens it and then you'll have it open in the bottom right in your hidden icon tray as well and you can pretty much just right click it from here and you can summon it to open up um like so and you can sign in and you can sign into your account from here and once you do this it's probably going to open the game that you did you know try to you know launch and sometimes it'll just uh, close afterwards as well so you can't open it back up that's where you will have to you know go to the bottom right and then just click Riot games here and uh, it'll open back up like that uh, pretty annoying i will say uh wish i didn't have to deal with it but i don't want to reinstall every game just to fix this so this is a little workaround um i saw some people also advise that you go into properties and then compatibility and then you can run a compatibility troubleshooter um this is probably different varying on what os you're on if you're on windows 11 from windows 10 it might be different so just keep that in mind and i've also seen people recommend that you know you disable full screen optimizations you turn that off if you have it on like so and uh yeah that's pretty much it just a quick one because this is an issue i've been having so might help some of you that are having the same issue okay see you later guys